Hello everyone, it is January 25th, 2015. Well, we're coming up on tax season, and for those of us that still file a tax return, I um, wanted to share a little letter that I received this week from the person that helps me with my taxes, and I wanted to share with you the first paragraph of this letter. And I've blackened out his name at the top right-hand corner of the paper, of the letter just to protect uh, his his name and his business but it says dear client happy new year I hope everyone had a wonderful holiday season this year the primary change in tax law relates to the mandatory health care provision known as the Affordable Care Act I will need to know from every client if they have health care with quote minimum essential coverage end quote Basically, and this legislation is quite complicated, I will need to know if you are covered by your employer, and in parentheses, it should be listed or indicated on your W-2, if you purchased insurance through an exchange, meaning, if so, you may have to pay back part of any credit you received, or you could receive an additional tax credit. If you have a specific exemption, some, like income below certain thresholds, are automatic. Others, you need a code obtained through the Health Insurance Marketplace, or IRS. Or, if you have no health insurance, you may be subject to a penalty of the greater of $95 or 1% adjusted gross income with additional adjustments. Please look over the enclosed tax update letter as it highlights health care changes. However, ignore changes for 2014 as Congress as of December 20th, 2014 extended all the provisions through December 31st, 2014. And yes, they again expire in 2015 unless reviewed. Well, I have to say that I find this very intrusive. And the fact that he needs to know from every client if they have health care with minimum essential coverage really kind of scares me. And the IRS knows everything about you and me and all of us poor schmucks out there who have to file or who choose to file a tax return. And my new explanation for the IRS, the acronym IRS, is Internal Rectum Service, because they are so invasive, just like getting a colonoscopy into your life. And if this thing is so great, why are people losing their health insurance? Why are people's deductibles going up? I don't understand the rules of this game. I hope everyone is doing well. Have a great day, everyone.